Hi everybody, it is Kim Braxton and I am back with you to share with you another poem. I have three, three things to mention. One is that my friend corrected me and said that I always say that my poems are entitled whatever the poem is. And she corrected me and said that a poem is titled. So I got that. And then again, she also said that I say the word poem and I mispronounce it, that it is pronounced poem. So I'm going to try to work on that too, but don't quote me because I've been saying poem all my life. I'm also wearing my pajamas because it is quite appropriate to the context. So the poem goes as follows. Why would you wear your pajamas to the DMV? Why would you wear your pajamas to the DMV? Why would you do that to your community? You want everyone to know that you actually don't give a damn and that you don't pay any taxes to Uncle Sam. You wear Betty Boop and he wears SpongeBob. Well, together you look like two slobs. Near one of you probably don't have a job because it only takes one minute to put on some shorts. You will probably wear them to court and then tell the judge that you're sorry. But it's too late because he already seen you on Maury. In your life, don't you want more? Then why would you wear them to the store? Your pants are right there on the floor. Buy your old beer, your blunt, and your dirty drawers. Now you mad and you want to throw them paws. Because people look at you like you're a scum. And they wonder where you're from. The projects, the ghetto, the barrio, the street. Perhaps around the corner from a swap meet. People see you and they tend to avoid eye contact because don't nobody feel like watching they back. But now this is just my opinion and not a fact, but I think it's lazy, shiftless, and they have no ambition. I wonder if they're afraid of life and competition. In the world, you got to get dressed to get ahead. You can't just roll out the bed, brush your teeth, and wash your face. You got to get it together and get up in the race. Get up, get dressed, and have a good day. Because I know you got some things you want to say. Make it happen and have it your way. But reconsider. And please, 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 don't wear your pajamas to the DMV or your slippers either. Thank you kindly for listening. I know that some of you will agree and some of you will not agree. I might get some backlash from this. This is not um, uh, decided for any race because I've been to the DMV many times and I've seen African-Americans. I've seen Hispanics. I've seen Caucasians and maybe two Asians who wear their pajamas to the DMV. It's something that we got to get together as a whole. So... Thank you for listening. If you like it, share it. And if you have some comments, share those with me as well. And thank you for listening and take care.